Hey, hello guys, my name is Angel Arrow and in this uh, tutorial video I'm going to show you how you can get this uh, V8 engine sound. It's a plug-in, it's not a modification, it's not a mod because mods are not allowed in the multiplayer, but a plug-in is. I'm just going to show you where you can download the plug-in and how you have to install it. Now there are two methods. There is a method for only the 64-bit version of the game and there is a method for the 46 or and 32-bit version of the game. So let's start with the 46-bit. Uh, um, this is the download link which I'm going to put in the description of this video. You just click confirm download then you click on free download the file is going to download, you just put it in a folder wherever you want but don't put it in the ETS2 game folder of course I'm going to put it in downloads here I click on save and then I'm going to open it in the folder where I've downloaded it and I'm going to unpack it I always unpack files with WinRAR it's a free to use tool that you can find through your search engine Alright, so we have a file here etsp underscore x64 64 bit that means underscore 2.zip. I'm going to unpack it. I always unpack to a new folder with the same name as the name of the RAR file. So that is what I do and we get a new folder here. So for the 64 bit you open that folder, you just copy these two files, it's one folder and one .dll file, both with the same name and Hans Truck Sound plugin. You copy these two and then if you don't know where to put it, you just go to your Steam and you go to the, um, let's say you go to your simulator games of course, you go to your truck simulator 2 you go to properties and there you go to local files browse local browse local files you click on that and the system is going to guide you towards um, where your local files are there you go into the bin folder in the bin folder you go to the win 64 bit folder and in there if you don't have a folder already that is called plugins you create one. You can simply create one by right clicking on the uh, white area new and then folder. I don't have to do that. I already have a plugins folder. Why? Because I'm already using plugins. People who use Truxbook for instance already have a plugins folder because Truxbook is one of the .dll files that is in there. So then you just open that plugins folder and you paste the two files that we copied earlier. So this is the method for the 64-bit version of the game. That's all you need to do. Now we are going to look for the 34-bit, 32-bit uh, version of the game. Therefore you go to another download link which I will put in the description of the video. Um, Apparently you go to a Google Drive where you find plugins.rar You download the file by in the upper right corner clicking on the download button So now I'm going to download the files myself Again I put it in my downloads folder I click save I go to that folder this is it, plugins.rar again you're going to extract or unpack that file I always do it to a new folder with the same name as the rar file oh wrong one and it's here, it's the plugins folder you open the plugins folder double clicking on it and then you have again a folder called plugins if you open that one you have um, again the two um, same names enhanced truck sound plugin data and enhanced truck sound plugin dot 
L D L L. You go one back. You say you copy that plugins folder. You just copy that plugins folder. Again, you go to your game. Um, your truck simulated to properties. Browse local files. It's going to bring you there. You double click the bin folder, and here you can put the. If you don't have a plugins folder, you just paste the plugins folder here. Uh, pasting here, you just paste it here. Um, then you will have a plugins folder with only these two files, and you do the same for Win. Um, x86 which means the 32-bit version of the game if you don't have the plugins folder here you just right click and paste the plugins folder and in that folder you will then have the two um, same files so I can do that here paste and he's going to say but we already have a folder called plugins or he doesn't ask it and he just puts the two files here in the right folder in the 32-bit folder so this is it ladies and gents this is all you have to do and then you can enjoy this wonderful V8 sound of this truck there are some things that you need to know first of all this is a plugin so it is allowed on the multiplayer it's only client side only you will hear that sound nobody else will hear it it's only for your truck not for all the other trucks around you it's only your truck and no matter which truck you drive or which engine you use you will always hear that same v8 sound all right folks this was it for this short tutorial, I hope you enjoyed and see you for the next one.